Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Lee Dixon. We've got action from the round of 16 in the Champions League to bring you. It's Porto versus Barcelona. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Well, we all expect Barcelona to go through this tie, but you just never know. They've got a huge squad, massive, massive amount of quality in that squad, but they're playing over two legs. You just never know how it's going to turn out. Should be a great game, we're expecting goals. Here's the starting 11 for Porto. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Samuel Umtiti starts alongside Clément Langlais in the centre of defence. And the strike partnership, Antoine Griezmann plays with Lionel Messi. And now this Champions League round of 16 first leg begins. Well, possibilities in the centre. Pjanic. And the pass could do damage. And Messi in full control of the ball here. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, he's every right to be angry. The players are not executing his game plan today. And the referee blows his whistle. That is the end of the contest. And a fine result for the away fans. And if they can repeat this sort of performance on home soil, then they will surely be going through. Yes, Derek, they have an advantage, but it's only a small one. There's not much between the two teams. Really good game of football. I'm really looking forward to that second leg, Derek. Hello, wherever you happen to be, welcome to Catalonia, welcome to Barcelona. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always, is Lee Dixon. And it's the Champions League round of 16, second leg. It's Barcelona facing Porto. Yeah, Derek, Barcelona just edged it in the first leg. I thought they played really, really well, but if they concede an early goal, it could be very, very interesting this game. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Samuel Umtiti starts alongside Clément Langlais in the centre of defence. And the starting striker today is Antoine Griezmann. Here's the starting 11 for Porto. 
And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. Lionel Messi's daredevil style of attacking could well make the difference here, Lee. Opportunity it is. And a goal! And I'll tell you what, that gives them a bit of a cushion now. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. Losing possession here. Barca now, it's a sector of the pitch devoid of defenders. Teammate available. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory moment! Well, as we can see again here, he knows exactly what he's doing and kids all the defenders with the cutback. And still with lots to do, he unleashes a very powerful effort. Gave the keeper little chance. Lovely goal that was. Well, they've been poor all day, Derek, and you sense there's going to be a rollicking in that dressing room after the game. Good-looking ball, there could be a chance now. And he clears it out of harm's way. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. And in with a real chance. Can he finish? A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him, gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Well, his players have followed his every command and some. The coach must be delighted. Now Griezmann. More action from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Barcelona against Real Sociedad. Will it be? A goal! An exceptional performance this. Four to the good now. Well, as we see again here, this really is patient, accurate, incisive passing at its best. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. De Jong now with Messi well he keeps going a goal we're really being spoiled this is attacking football at its finest well you could be critical of the defending but let's focus on the great play capped off with a superb calm calculated finish Let's have another view of that goal. Oh, 
Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek. He's not happy. Just look at him. And that's it, the final whistle, and the hosts will go through. Well, you can't say, Derek, they didn't deserve it. By far the better team over two legs. All departments of their team was functioning well. The midfield dominated, and up front they were clinical. The thing about Lionel Messi is we expect that he'll take games by the scruff of the neck, and he's done that this evening. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.